My original plan was to build a conventional wood-framed home because that's the way we've always built them. But this time I decided to go ICF, which is insulated concrete forms. And that means that all the exterior walls will be foam blocks that are filled with concrete and that's right from the footings all the way up to the roof. I've always been kind of interested in it because of the high R value, the thermal mass of the wall, and just the strength of the building envelope itself. Today is a big day. The truck is here with all the insulated concrete forms, so we can take them in, uh, and the ICF crew is here, so we'll start laying out all the blocks on the footings that will form the foundation wall. So, pretty excited. Once you've pinned it, snapped your lines, you're gonna lay out your first course of block. On the line. And then the first course, you're gonna tie them end to end. These go in the middle? Correct. Then you're going to lay your first course of steel into one of these chairs. Okay. So I'll see the e button. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, yeah. Adam can handle this. Then you're going to do your second course. And tie the blocks together? Yeah, just to hold the whole system together. Okay, so that's holding these two. And I do both corners of the corners only. Yeah. Once you get up to about four courses, your bracing system helps to plumb the walls, but it also acts as your scaffold system as well. Okay. So when you're pouring concrete, you'll be able to stand up there and pour the concrete into the walls. Hello? Coming out? I hope those are your <laughs> dirty jeans. Are you going to meet me? Yeah, come on. Things look like they're moving along. Yeah. I see progress when I get home from work. And it looks to me like it's going as planned. I thought they'd be harder, but they're kind of like soft and soft. Well, they will once they're full of concrete. We have the foundation walls formed with the ICF block. So we have eight or nine concrete trucks coming today, and we're going to fill up these walls. Oh, look how mad he is. I want to pour concrete. <laughs> We've broken his spirit. We've soured the trades for him. Now he wants to. He wants to go into art or something. The big difference here, obviously, is that we're building with ICF forms. <laughs> Not only do we get the energy savings of having the insulation in place, but the concrete that we're using is made with Contempra, which will reduce the greenhouse gases that go into the manufacturing of the cement, and that reduces the carbon footprint of the entire house. It's just a double bang here. We save money uh, on the heat, and we're helping the environment by using concrete that has less greenhouse gas emissions. Yeah, you gotta pay attention though. Don't put too much in one spot. I enjoy the days when I get to work with Brian, a little more hands-on. It's a little exhilarating. He's a pro. For this home, it's very different. I've never even seen a home built of concrete. So it's a new, it's a new project, it's a new adventure. Maybe we should go get a coffee. I think it's great when she comes out, gets a little more involved in the dirty side of building. It's not all about what colors it gonna be and you know, what type of flooring should we choose? But you know, a lot of it is, let's get splashed with concrete. It, it's sweaty, it's it's tough work. I think she had fun. Cool, eh? That was really cool. Yeah. Next those you can build. The majority of this floor system is hung, meaning that the ledgers are attached to the concrete walls. Where are we going? The first one. The joists are hung on the ledgers. We've got the beams that are flush mounted, supported by posts, so there's more hangers on the beams to hold the other side of the joists. And the second floor soon, this will be cool. Different view from up here of the trees. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm approaching my happy place. Not quite there yet. 